Welcome back, everybody. I'm your host with the most. Um, let us see here. Uh, uh, <laughs> I'm going to have a kind of a moment, a relapse here. Oh, right, of course. Go Brewers, in case you can't see my, um, my little, my little uh, emblem there. Um, I am, in fact, a Brewers fan. I'm from Milwaukee, and I am just in love with what they've been doing to the Cubs, mainly. <laughs> Um, you know, I, I live in Chicago now, and um, I've always been a pretty big Brewers fan uh, since college, because I wasn't into sports before college, but now I'm, I'm pretty into it, and I really am a, have become quite the Brewers fan. Now, I do think um, I do think that uh, I also am a Braves fan. I'm originally from Atlanta, but, you know, I, I grew up, I, I did a lot of growing in Milwaukee, so I have some affinity to that city as well. And... Um, you know, uh, they're doing great this season so far. Had kind of a rough start with the Reds, but, you know, have, have been making do, so good, good. Um, it's funny because when you go to Milwaukee and you see anybody with Cubs gear, they get a nasty, nasty um, grimace from, uh, I guess grimace is in fact the wrong word, maybe more like a disgusted look, um, uh, from any Brewers fan in terms of, in terms of, uh, what their what their what their deal is uh, with the Cubs, but when I when I when I wear Brewers gear and stuff in in Chicago, the Cubs fans don't seem to care as much as the Brewers fans. I mean, the Brewers fans spill a lot of haterade on Cubs and and their fan base, and it's funny because the Chicagoans straight up just don't care. So, so it, it's always kind of like a one sided battle, and we're like, yeah, good, you don't care, <laughs> but it, but it really doesn't matter because nobody actually. I, I think at least. So you notice that I'm kind of hanging out in the building, and the reason that I'm doing this is because I think that I'm going. Ugh, I was upset about that. Uh, I was going for a um, a contract, like a get 11 kills or something like that, uh, which was one of the one of today's contracts. So it was really important for me to kind of keep keep my distance and, and and play pretty conservatively because you know it's, it's no easy task. So I'm doing my best to uh, to finish contracts, and I actually get. Finish top in TDM and get the 11 kill streak, both on the first try today. So I was I was pretty impressed with myself, to be honest. Um, yes. So uh, I'm hoping that I will get to go to some Brewers games this 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 time around. I was unable to go to a single one last year, and I was pretty upset about it. But this time around, ought to ought to be a little bit better. So let us see if I get a chance. And just uh, terrible shooting. Didn't get anybody. Uh, this guy. Thankfully gets iced, and then I don't know what I do there. Oh, get grenaded. Of course. Mistakes were made. Um, blow myself up. Uh, yeah, so I'm kind of uh, been talking. I've been actually recording a couple of commentaries so that I have a few in the bank. And honestly, I'm kind of like running low on, on stuff to talk about. I really need to make a little list next time. Sometimes I'm able to just talk freely, but a lot of times I do, in fact... Um, you need to have a topic, you know. It's always good to have a topic. But, you know, I just have been doing whatever. You know, I guess I've been trying to listen more um, in terms of politics and and listen about what's been going on in the country. But you know, in in all, in all honesty, I I think that there's just so many lies and and so many opinionated views that it's just too difficult to really find the honest truth and. So I listen with with a tainted with a, with, a, with a tainted ear or a grain of salt or whatever you like to say. Um, I just you know it, it's kind of just our country's in debt and we really need to work on fixing that. And I and I'm not actually in fact I excuse my comment. I am in fact not ever going to bring up a political affiliation in a commentary simply because I just think that people. People just differ in views greatly, and I think that that's good and healthy, and I do not want to impose on anybody else's views um, with my own. So, uh, maybe I can talk a little bit more about the gameplay. Actually, you know, I am going to talk a little bit about I'm, I'm pretty excited for the summer because, you know, I've been having, like, some wicked cabin fever. Keep cabin deployed. fever since... It's been so cold. I mean, uh, you know, here in Chicago, and, and I really am just looking very forward to to some uh, some warm weather, some summer activities, some concerts, and um, yeah. So, in fact, speaking of concerts, I am going to go on the 22nd, which is a Friday, to um, 
to Rusko, so I'm going to be pretty excited for that. And if you guys don't know who Rusko is, he's a UK dubstep icon. And, you know, I wasn't too into dubstep at first, but I had a, a co-worker that was really into it and kind of got me hooked on it. And, I, you know, I think it's it's pretty fun and um, interesting beats. And it's a, you know, it's a definitely a fun, fun, fun music. So it'll just definitely be an interesting con uh, concert. So, you know... Got the finally got the dog. Uh, needed one more, and was just desperate to get this contract. And luckily, I get some crazy ass kill like that right before I get iced here. So that kind of sucked. But I did in fact get the payoff, so that was pretty nice. Uh, I don't know what happened there. Something wrong with I guess how the game recorded, but um, not bad. So 26 and four. And thanks for watching.